Hey everybody, welcome to the back-to-back -back episodes of Unboxing Judge Dredd. Now, I, if you've not seen the other video, make sure you go watch that. It was the one before this one. Uh, it is their newest release, the Lone Wolf box set, which contains some great models. The cards sadly let down that set, but we are moving on to the next one. I finally bought the utility truck. I've been slow on buying the vehicles. I wasn't super taken by them. I thought they were expensive. They're big lumps of resin as well. But they have cards, and I didn't realize at the time, so I've now started buying them slowly. But yeah, this is a massive lump. I'm sad that it doesn't have a box. I am a box collector. But instead we get a bag of bubble wrap, which we will slowly slide everything out because I don't know what we got. This looks like... Big chunk of resin to shave off there. So this is the undercarriage. Let's see if I can get my camera focused a bit better. There we go. So the wheels are obviously sticking on here. Everything else is going to go on top. We have one wheel. This is pretty clean. Now there's some chunks there that need to be smoothed down. It's going to go like so. I think all four wheels are the same, so it doesn't really matter which way around I do this. Got second wheel, obviously would go there. If I can get it to fit. There we go. Then a third wheel. Ooh. Anything else? A fourth wheel, so we got all four wheels. And then the top canopy. This is a big chunk of resin. The vehicles are quite comical because they are so heavy and resiny. There's a little bit of clean up there that needs doing. But ultimately, a very clean casting. Very nicely done. Not going to complain about that. And then I imagine it's going to go like that. It does seem to have some gaps. Oof. I guess you probably won't see it once I've coloured it and shaved and sanded some areas. But this is going to be the profile. Looks pretty damn nice to me. It's going to be fun to paint. Little instruction guide on resin and obviously an advert. We then get some options. We can make it a recycle van or Morgan's Munch or the Hottie House. I'm not sure how I'm going to paint this one. Recycle obviously makes for a fun vehicle, but I could also make it a Waylon Yutani. Have it fit in with the alien stuff that I'm currently doing as well. This was packaged by Anna. Thank you very much. And it is the utility truck. And that is the only card. Oh, I was hoping for like, I don't know, an armory or a big mech card as well. Uh, it is a vehicle, comes with no weapons, can carry eight passengers, moves nine inches, can fight four, defense five, a cooler three, costs 19 points, has eight passengers, carries, all vehicles can carry at least two passengers in comfort, while some can carry more, activate model within one inch of vehicle, can take a seat. Passengers may disembark by expending a single action to get off. That is it. Look at that. Quick and dirty. Only a four minute video. Uh, this is going to take some cleaning and some washing. Just saw them on that. Oof. They'll need to be cleaned off. But it's got a very nice profile. Um, let's see if I can find a model. Luckily I have a judge on hand. Just to give you a sense of scale. That is a big boy. That is actually horrendously huge compared to a model. I love it. But anyway, hope you enjoyed. Let me know if you've got any questions about it, and I'll see if I can answer them. And until next time, cheers for watching. Beep, beep.